After more video emerge of assassins outside the private home of Haiti's president, less than 24 hours later came the first arrest. Authorities now say seven suspects were killed during a gun battle and six others are now in custody. I'm also aware that a larger group of possible perpetrators have taken refuge in two buildings in the city and that they are now surrounded by the police. New footage appears to show heavily armed men moving down the street around the time President Jovenel Moise was assassinated. In separate audio, a voice can be heard identifying the group in English as DEA agents. The Haitian government says they also spoke Spanish and were foreign mercenaries posing as DEA agents. The country's ambassador won't say who may have paid them or whether they had inside help. We don't want to speculate. Uh, there was an investigation going on. First Lady Martine Moise was critically wounded and is being treated at a Miami hospital. In Haiti, the prime minister has declared a state of siege. Today, protesters gathered outside a police station where suspects were being held. And late today, Haiti's Minister of Elections confirms to NBC News that at least one U.S. citizen is among those in custody. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.